So here we are, race fans, at round five of the WA Development Series for Late Models, sponsored by AJN Transport. We're uh, out at Calabarian Speedway today and talking to one of the success stories from the Development Series is Peter Seaton. Peter, uh, how many years have you been racing Late Models now? Um, this is my second year in the Development Series and I've done um, two sort of half years in the Pro Dirt rounds. And um, yeah, no, I'm really enjoying it, it's great. And would you uh, say that the development series has sort of helped fast track your learning or? Oh, it's one of the best ways you can learn because you don't have the pressure of the pro dirt round. The guys with bigger cars, more experience, sort of overrun you all the time. I'll tell you what impresses me about your driving, Peter, is um, it's probably not the most powerful car in the field. And uh, I think a lot of people have the impression that you need a big motor to succeed in late models, but I've seen you do some good things in this, uh, this car. Uh, basically standard 350 sham, um, runs um, fuel heads on it, um, runs on methanol, um, nothing major done to it, it's got a cam in it, um, and that's about it. You know, it probably puts out 350 horsepower, maybe 400 horsepower max. What's your plans for the upcoming season? You're going to do some summer racing? And... Yeah, we'll give it a crack at the Pro Dirt round, the first round, that one. We'll see how we go. I'm still learning to drive the power because, you know, I've gained probably 300 horsepower. I'll tell you what, you impressed me last year, especially at Kalgoorlie with the small motor, so uh, some of the faster guys might have to keep an eye on the rear view mirror. Hopefully. Peter Seaton, race fans, uh, keep an eye out for him this summer. I think he's a man on the way up.